hypothesis testing of the population mean of a continuous variable using the normal distribution. Uh, the lifetime of bulbs are normally distributed with the population mean of 600 and standard deviation 55. A random sample of 10 were selected with the following lifetimes. So we can work out the sample mean from these values. We're going to use a 10% significance level to investigate if there has been a decrease in the lifetime of the bulbs. So this will be a one-tailed test. So the population mean is 600. The standard deviation was 55, so the variance will be 55 squared. The sample size is 10. The sample mean follows the normal distribution, like this. So we can replace these values with the ones that we have here. So 600 for the population mean. Sigma squared is uh, 55 squared and n is 10. And the sample mean can be calculated from the data given and works out to be 579.7. So this will be our test value. So the null hypothesis, H0, the population mean, is 600. And we're investigating a decrease. So H1, the population mean, is less than 600. And we're using a 10% significance level. 10%. Because we're looking for a decrease, we're on the left hand side of the normal distribution. So this is 10% for significance level. So we have 90% on this side. This is the accept H0 region. This is the reject H0 region. It's the critical region. We have a critical value here. And our test value will be this. We're going to look up a probability of 0.90, 90%. We go to the normal tables is 90%, 0.90, the z-value is 1.282, and it's on the left-hand side, so it's negative, the mean was 600, and now we're going to use this the z-value, the critical z-value, to work out the sample mean here, which is the critical value that will go here. So in the standardizing formula, population mean goes here, divided by this has to be the standard deviation, so we've got the variance, which is 55 squared over 10. So we need to square root it to get the standard deviation. So we rearrange this to work out our critical value that goes here. We get our critical value as 577.7. So on this number line, 579.7 will be here somewhere. That's our test statistic. 579.7. The test value is in the acceptance region. So we're going to accept H0. There's no evidence for the alternative hypothesis. 
so we will conclude that there is no significant evidence that the population mean lifetime has decreased. So here's the conclusion. And the conclusion in context. And defining the acceptance and rejection regions may be useful for working out the probability of uh, type 2 and type 1 errors. And because we've accepted H0, it's possible that a type 2 error was made.